Grief has stricken Gwakigwi village in Juja, Kiambu County, after hyenas mauled a 10-year-old boy to death. The boy, who was a grade 4 pupil, was with three friends when they were attacked by a clan of hyenas. The incident comes even as the Kenya Wildlife Service continues with an operation to capture the hyenas, which have killed several people in Juja. Residents blamed the increased hyena attacks on abandoned quarries and bushy chunks of land that have remained undeveloped for years. Rose, Rose Wangwe has more details. A family in Gwakigwi village in Juja, Kiambu County is mourning after their 10 year old son was mauled to death by a pack of hyenas on Wednesday evening. Dennis Tear, a grade four pupil, was in the company of his friends when the marauding hyenas attacked them as they were heading home. They scampered and ran to their homes, but area residents later found out that one of them was missing. Villagers initiated a search for the missing boy and discovered a trail of blood leading to the swamp where they found him. <laughs> na hiyo hiyo fisi ikamfuta kama mita eh, mita 300 fisi hizo zikiendelea eh, ziki, kumaliza watoto kama hao tutapotelea maisha, eh, maisha ya uzoni hatuna his search ended in pain and agony after his blood stained clothes were found in a nearby bush the remains of the boy were recovered this morning the residents live in fear and rarely move out of their houses in the evenings later the night and early morning for fear of the marauding animals bado zililala zikiwika eh jana zilikuwa zilikuja kitu kama saa moja hapo usiku imelala ikiwika saa 11 ilikuwa huko zilikuwa huko na sasa tuko na uoga sana tugeomba serikali tushughulikie kwa sababu mande watoto wako shule na wanaenda mbali hatuna na depot ya, ya matakataka sasa eh, diposa inasunguka tu inasungusha tu watu kwa maboma zao the attack occurred even as a team of 20 Kenya wildlife service officers were hunting down the killer animals in villages within Waitaithi and Kalimoni wards following persistent attacks that have left a trail of deaths. The crackdown was ordered last month when the hyenas attacked and killed a woman in Nyashaba village as she headed to work early in the morning. Before the killing of Joyce Wamboi, the animals had mauled to death a nine-year-old boy. KWS has intensified the hunt for the hyenas by installing more traps across the villages, adding that so far they have managed to capture over 10 hyenas. There are these abandoned quarries and bazos as it will make it. It's a fish in the Osinagua and Mashimo, who combine my bazos are pushing. Askari Wetu, Wakiungaza, and Askari Wengine. Watakuwa kipiga chukua doria, wakipiga doria katika sehemu tofauti tofauti ambazo tumeweza ku uh, identify na kujua ya kwamba hao ofisi wako. The officials have also called on parents in the region to be extra cautious with their kids and ensure that they are at home when dusk sets in. Wale wazazi wakiweza kuunganda kwa vikundi waweze kuwazindikiza wale watoto kwenda shule. Nao pia askari wetu wakiongeza na askari wengine Area leaders have also called for the deployment of more KWS officers to intensify the operation. Rosongui, NTV.